Hi, my name is Sarah Mednick. I'm an associate professor in the Department of Cognitive Sciences. I just arrived in January 2018 and I came from uh, UC Riverside. Uh, so I got my PhD at Harvard University and before that I was an undergraduate in theater at Bard College in Annandale on the Hudson in New York. And then I sort of found myself working as an actress in New York and then I realized this is not for me and then I somehow I found myself working in a mental hospital and that's when I realized mental illness and the brain was really my own uh, passion and got a, a PhD from Harvard University in psychology and then took a postdoc at the Salk Institute in San Diego in La Jolla and that's when San Diego and the West Coast really seemed like the place to be and then I got a uh, a assistant professorship at UCSD and then I moved to UC Riverside and here I am at the greatest of all UCs, UC Irvine. Super happy to be here. Um, my research examines sleep. In particular, what are the cognitive processes that go on when we're sleeping that allow us to become smarter, brighter, uh, more emotionally um, whole, and uh, healthy people. I look at the brain through various different measurements. I use electroencephalography, fMRI. We use pharmacology to look at the neural mechanisms of sleep. Um, and we're using brain stimulation as well to be able to use electrical brain stimulation during sleep to see if we can interfere or in interfere with or enhance certain sleep processes and then have downstream cognitive benefits. I'm very interested in aging and in how aging changes the brain and how we can improve um, our sleep and maybe improve some of age-related decline in memory. Uh, and I'm very excited to be here at UCI because there's a very strong computational component here that really matches my interest in building, you know, a real big interesting idea of how the way the brain really is working and it really requires really good computational skills. I'm super excited to be working with the Center for Learning and Memory to have people who really understand consolidation and what goes on during memory. Um, and I feel like there's a great bridge then um, between cognitive science and memory that I'm going to be able to explore here. So I'm excited to be here.